Machaban, Ismi Simon, Siritu Bilika Ika. Hello everyone and welcome to Reggae Boys Commentary. I'm Simon Preston. I know it's not the usual attire that I normally have, but did something new. Let's just put it that way, shall we? So, as you can see by the title of this video, Fabio Dixon, The Decision. Who is Fabio Dixon? Well, Fabio Dixon is a 21-year-old right-back who plies his trade with FC Chiasso in the Swiss Challenge League. It's essentially the second tier of Swiss football. And why are we talking about this player in particular? He was born to a Jamaican father, and by extension, his, his paternal side of the family is from Jamaica. That's the reality of the situation. He has represented Switzerland at youth level, Switzerland at under 18 and at under 19 level. So what's the situation? Fabio Dixon wants to play for Jamaica. Had dialogue with him quite recently and it was along these lines. I want to play for Jamaica but at this point in time I want to ensure that I make my transfer coming up. There's two offers that he has on the table. One to the Middle East <laughs> And the other is in Europe. So he's considering his options and he says after he makes that proposed move, then he would love to, do to don the colors in the black, green and gold. He is 21, let's not forget as well. So he could very much be part of our 2026 pool as well, if, if needs be. At this point in time, what does he bring to the equation? Good crosses, good defensive ability. If there is something that I want him to work on, it would be his physical aspect of the game. When crosses are coming over to wide areas, I still think that aerially he still has something to improve on. So that's something that I think he can improve on as time progresses in terms of his physically imposing presence of the game. But can he pass? Yes. Can he cross the football? Yes. Can he defend? Yes. So he has most of the tools in his locker to be able to manipulate professional football and to manage the Reggae Boys uh, section, Reggae Boys national team. So Fabio Dixon, he is the man, Fabio Dixon wants to play for Jamaica and he is very much keen on doing so in the near future. So we'll have to see where, where that is concerned, where Fabio is. Fabio wants to play for Jamaica, he has been interested, you know, this is an individual that can speak Pato quite well as well. He loves oxtail and rice and peas, this is a guy that idolizes you know, some of the players that we that we had in the past, the Marlon Kings, the Ricardo Fullers, the Bibi Gardeners. This guy just, you know, he, he wears Jamaica on his sleeve. Right now, though, he says his focus is to moving, leaving FC Chiasso and getting that move either to the Middle East and also to the, or Europe. And speaking of the Middle East, you know, like the attire that I have on and everything like that, there's interest in this market and we've spoken about it ever since the Saudi Arabia friendly matches as well, haven't we? So, my attire is, is of the Arabic customs and people may say, is this something religious? No, it's by no means religious. If you, if you look at the attire and the headwear, it's actually used to help to feel cool. And when I mean cool is, and I mean not sweat or get hot because of the warm temperatures because the majority of these countries are in the desert areas so these are critical and important for for these players in terms of the well not players but people in this area that wear this sort of attire so by no means it should be viewed as a shock or or anything like, like that so the Middle East Asia UAE Qatar Egypt these are markets that are opening up and where our reggae boys are concerned, I don't think we should turn away from these markets. The goal is Europe. That's where we all want to be. If a player, especially during this pandemic, is without a club, I see no problem with him spending six months here or 12 months. And then getting that exposure, getting that game time, he can make that progression over to Europe, whether it's Scandinavia, Eastern Europe, the championship. The opportunities will be there for us. And just like Fabio Dixon said, it, where his focus is, our focus, especially for the local players, should be exploiting these markets because there are opportunities and the opportunities in abundance. They want Jamaicans and they are willing to pay. So, the question is, 
are the agents of these local players doing their absolute best to look at these opportunities? Or is it just Mahaban Shukran? Well, certainly there's some work to be done, and hopefully that work is done quite shortly. Reggae Boys fans, don't forget to subscribe to Reggae Boys Commentary. Really, really close to 8,000 subscribers here on this channel. Don't forget as well to to follow us on, on Twitter at rboyscom. You know, I'm on Twitter as well, simonp93. Reggae Boys Commentary on here on YouTube, close to 8,000 subscribers. Really, really close to 10K, you know. This project was started March 2016, and now we're in our fifth year anniversary. Can you imagine that? Bye. Good things take time and they'll definitely continue to, to make progress. So Reggae Boys fans, thank you very much for all your support. And don't forget to subscribe to Reggae Boys Commentary. Take care, guys.